Hey guys, welcome to this part. In this part, I am going to add more filter criteria. So, first of all, I want to make a separate project and I want to give the project name as part 4 or part 5. And I want to copy the previous JavaScript files over here and HTML contents. to the new page okay all right so what I want to add first I want to add some for example select option over here so what can I do I can say something sort by oops so sort by select ng model and I can give a model name order let's say order property okay so oops so what I need to I need to add options over here option value equal let's say name based on name so it will display alphabetical order the in the second option I want to add based on what based on year so you can say you can see you can add year or you can add newest okay so if you add these things over here then what we need to do is we need to add one more property in the items so what is the one more property is you know year so I have added year a small okay year and let's say this is 2000 um, 13 similarly I need to add properties over here 2014 and this is 2015 okay all right so now what to do go to the index page again then I need to add order by filter over here so it is order by order by what order by oops order property right so order property so what can we do we can select the browser and we can run and let's see okay so yep it's working newest alphabetical you know newest and even you can select Motorola okay alphabetical newest that means what it is working so we don't need this right now this is your homework <laughs> you have to do that part that means what it is working properly right so you can select alphabetical newest or whatever you want even that you can see you have Motorola but still you can add I mean you can source by order okay so 
Um, okay, sword is coming here. So what you can do is you can make it the paragraph. So it will be in the separate paragraph. Then you can add a styles over there. Okay. So if you want, you want to keep inside of that. I mean, with that though. So what you have to do is nothing. Just simply you have to add oops so it will be here okay so that means what your alphabetical sorting is working properly now this is coming based on what newest okay based on newest now if we want to add based on oldest then what you have to do for example you want to add which is based on oldest okay then what will be you can see newest and oldest are same so simply you have to add a minus over here and let's see oldest 2015 14 13 and if it's newest opposite you know so this is reverse sort or whatever you want if you want to make a reverse sort just simply you need to put a minus sign so it will make the reverse sort okay and if you notice one thing by default it is not sorting in any way so we can even set the default order so you need to add default order I mean default sorting order by adding a scope dot order property equal based on what um based on let's say name okay so this is your default sorting order now we can see so default sorting order it is not visible over here but it is default sorting order okay so so in this lesson you have learned a lot of things which is you know filter criteria order by and how to add you know order properties and how to set default order by so all those things you have learned in this lesson now you need to do practice a lot make similar kind of project and apply there and if you have any other kinds of project please apply this uh, AngularJS directives then you can learn from here and you can practice it in your application okay so thank you very much if you have any question or any doubt please feel free to write in the comment box if you like to give me a feedback whatever positive or negative you can write in the comment box okay thank you